Hi there, my name is Jenny and today I want to show you something that I made. So this awesome book right here uh, is a little thing called a smash book. Um, intro note, my mom has worked at a craft store for the past 15 years so I'm pretty much always up on the latest like crafty trend type things. Um, but this one is my favorite in a long, 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 long time. Um, and clearly Smashbook didn't pay me to pay this because like no one's watching but um, it's really fun it's like I feel like the scrapbooking craze you know it was kind of like oh everything has to be like gorgeous and like well put together and like it has to be like an heirloom that you pass down to future generations and that was just really stressful to me that's like a lot of pressure um, so when the Smashbook came out I was like I think I think I can get on this bandwagon it's supposed to look kind of junky kind of collagey um, and, like, you're encouraged to, like, write stuff and whatever, and they have, like, a lot of cool accessories that I get really excited about, because I'm a craft nerd, and that's what I get excited about. Um, but the first page I ever did, Ready Nerd Fighters, um, was about the Fault in Our Stars coming out. Um, I'm really proud of this page. I think it might be one of my favorite ones. Um, and I did some journaling about how my friend Bethany and I, who is pictured here, um, went on a Yeti hunt to find a Yeti, a signed Yeti in the book, when it first came out. Um, we both got a Hankler fish, um, but neither of us managed to find a Yeti. Um, but I just like did some lettering, which I think is really fun. And then um, my favorite little piece is that I cut like a cloud out of felt. <laughs> that looks like the cloud on the cover, you know? <laughs> and I embroidered it onto the page, uh, and it says the Great Yeti Hunt on it. And I was just really excited about that. That was a really fun page to make, and I think that's what got me hooked, is that I like spent so much time like making this really fun. Um, some of the other pages I didn't spend as much time on, and they're not quite as polished. I also worked on a few collages to like just like fill the pages out, because I didn't have really a whole ton of stuff to do, so I cut a bunch of pictures out of magazines um, to make some collages. One of my favorite ones is actually on the last page, uh, so you're going to get to see the first and the last page. Um, and I just cut strips out of magazines and then glued them all together, and um, that was really fun to do. Another highlight is my spring break page. Um, at the beginning of spring break last year, I got to go see Julia Noons in concert. Um, that's who's right there. And the ticket is in this cute little pocket thing, which was really fun. And yeah, that was also a fun page to make, and I'm proud of how it came out. So yeah, this whole book chronicles from January to about August of last year. Um, and then in August I left to go on my trip to Ireland, so I bought a new one to do that, but there's nothing in it yet except a few notes about planning and stuff. So yeah, I have some stuff to look forward to. Stuff is falling out of it. Typical. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of addicted to smash booking. Um, I want to know if you guys do anything like this as well, where you, like, get ticket stubs. I have ticket stub pages or, like, programs and, um, pictures and journaling. Here's one of when my parents and I went to Pikes Peak. I just want to know, like, if you have anything like that that you keep things in, because I think that's, I'm really into, like, memories and nostalgia and, oh, like, looking back on the good old times, and, um, this is really good for that, and I wanted to know if you guys have anything like that as well. If so, tell me in the comments or make a video response, that would be sick, and I, I think that's all I have to say today, besides, check out what I made. Um, I will see you all soon. Bye! Mm -hmm.